What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com doing a quick one box break of 2017 18 Upper Deck V Cup Hockey number one random number block, which is a one box break. So, 10 spots. Every random, every spot will get a random number from 0 through 9. You get number three, you'll get any card with being three on the first number next to the dash on the left side of the dash. So, for example, any card that comes out of 243 of 299, that would be your card for block three, 13 of 99, 3 of 25, and so on, of course. All redemption cards will go to spot zero, even if it's a known one of one. And any non-numbered cards are randomized in one lot at the end of the break. All redemptions go to spot zero. So there you go. And here's the dice roller. List of customers from Jeremy down to Richard. Last spot mojo. And zero through nine. So let's roll the dice. And it is a one and a three, so four times. Good luck, four times. One, two, three, four. After four times, Richard, down to Chris. All righty, four times. One, two, three, and four. Four times, one down to zero. All right, so Richard, you got spot one. William with nine. Jeremy with three. Richard, last spot mojo, six. David with two. William with eight. Matt Buckler, you got four. Jeremy with five. Darren with seven. And Chris, you got spot zero. So I'll give you guys a quick minute. If you guys would like to make any trades, about 30 seconds, sorry. And uh, if not, we'll start the break. But remember, guys, this cup hockey is very nice. It's a very high-end product. Only six cards per box. But very, very nice stuff. I ripped up in a ton of this stuff last year. Uh, and I still believe there's some very big Besser RPA still hiding out there. So hopefully we can pull some really nice stuff. Stephen K gets two in the Noir random number block and then the Pelicans. Ooh, Shield 101 would be awesome, right? So, yeah, we should be down to two in Noir. Uh, we're looking at eight or nine for trade. All right, and then we'll also use the same dice roller to determine which box we're going to use in this break. So we'll use it four times, and then we'll number the boxes out really quick. And then we'll see which box number we'll choose out of here. All right, sorry about that. Well, let's just close the trade window. Stick with what you got. Right, let me quickly print this out. All right, let me open up the case really quick. So this is a six box master, so. Not guaranteed, but there could be some very nice stuff in here, including an RPA to 99. Flip these around. Alright. And I'm just going to quickly number these. One, two, three, four, five. Horrible six, but it's going to pass. <laughs> And there you go. So one through six. And now let's quickly switch screens one last time. Use the same dice roll. Open up a new list. And we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. And it was four times. One, two, three, and four. 
four. After four times, box one. So it'll be box one up here. These will be for future breaks, which I think the next one's already in the store and a couple spots taken. And here's the sheet one last time. Richard with six, Donna William. There you go. No problem, Steve. guys it's not going down or it could be one of those huge cards that yeah, is a booklet oh and it's a rookie Alrighty, well, good luck. Let's go with the first base card. And it's Sergei Bobrovsky. It's 44 of 249. So that's spot four. Going to Matt Buckley. Where's, where's Bobrovsky going to go, guys? And we got Lucas Walmart, RPA. 66 of 249, three color patch. That is six, spot six. That's going to Richard, last ball mojo. Next one we got is a James Neal three color patch for the Vegas Golden Knights. 15 of 99, so spot five. That's Jeremy M. Let me actually go get some more 180s really quick, guys. Spot five. What's up, Julo? Next one we got Anders Bjork. Twenty three of thirty six. Rookie autograph. Spot three going to Jeremy. Alright, next one we got a two of five quads for the Bruins. Charlie McAvoy, Jack of Forrest, Baca Carlson, Jake DeBrusque, and Anders Bjork. Very, very nice. That's all the top rookies in their class. Spot two going to David. Wow, I I think this booklet is a I think this booklet's a duel as well. It's not too shabby. It's very nice. All right, and the booklet. I think this booklet's going to be sick, guys. Good luck. It's a duel. Oh, wow, for the Colorado Avalanche. Dual rookie. Dual auto rookie bookmarks. Alex Kerfoot and Samuel Gerrard. Wow, very nice. Look at that. Solid patches in there as well. I don't, I don't think these are numbered, guys. Wow. Everybody's going to have a shot at this. I, I believe these rookie uh, gear booklets are odds now. They're not numbered anymore. Yeah, these aren't numbered. <laughs> Everybody's going to have a shot at this. Right? I believe non-numbered cards are random in a lot. Yeah. There you go.
So, if you did go hitless, you're going to have a chance to get that booklet straight up. So let's get the list of customers in the break. And we'll see who's going to win this booklet, guys. And remember, guys, any non-numbered cards are randomized in one lot. Just to let you know. So everybody will have a shot at that. And let's get the list of customers. There you go. Let's roll it. Good luck, everybody. That's a nice booklet to get, especially if you're an Avalanche fan. A six and a three, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine times, we're going to go to William at the top after nine times. So there you go. William, you try to trade one of your eight or nines. So there you go. That'll be your booklet. And that is a break, guys. That was Cup Hockey, random number block number one. If we refresh this, I believe number two is already in stock. And it's one spot taken. So there you go. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. We'll see you.